Hello everyone, I'm Roger Newcomb. Welcome to We Love Soaps TV. I'm Damon L. Jacobs and we are here at the So Long Springfield Bon Voyage Cruise Party. Right, it's at SD26 as you can see behind us or maybe not. Um, <laughs> we're going to have a lot of interviews with the Guiding Light Stars who are going on the cruise tomorrow. So stay tuned, you won't want to miss this. Michael O'Leary, it is so great to see you again. Fantastic, thank you. Fantastic. Thank so you. we were just noticing that um, a lot of the stars that arrived tonight kind of came by foot or by cab, but you actually arrived in a limo. What's up with that? I think Rob came with a, a, a 1997 Ford Taurus, and as oh, the car the car is gone now. <laughs> but I, what happened? I had a. Uh, I don't know, 60 yard stretch uh, limo, and it has nothing to do with who's important and who's not important. Of course not, no, that wouldn't matter, because no. I know it does matter because I watch Steamboat, and I know what's what from watching that show. Thank you. The boat, uh, the boat's still floating. Okay. Well, hopefully by the end of this weekend, the cruise ship will be floating too. Yes, I've never been on a boat before, so I got my bracelet. And I'm taking the Dramamine, and I got a bottle of tequila. All right. So this is revealing. The Star Steamboat has never actually been on a boat. That's, no, that's, that's right. Fascinating. The, the writer and producer of a show called Steamboat has never been on a boat, <laughs> ever. <laughs> Ever. So what's in store this weekend? You know what? We love Soaps Weekend. We loved your comedy, and you were so wonderful to have around, and you were so funny. Are we going to see any, are the uh, fans going to see that this weekend on the cruise? Yes, they are. Uh, they're going to see a new, I have a whole new uh, routine that I've been working on, so, you know, I'm going to be expanding beyond the Guiding Light stories. That's which, great. Uh, which you heard that we, we, can, we can't mention on the air. We're going to mention that on the air, but... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> is any potentially, um, let's say, scandalous material in this routine? Or are you kind of going to play it safe on the cruise? Uh, I'm going to, you know, just make fun of everybody who's there. Okay. Uh, I haven't gone after Grant, and I think Grant needs to be going after. Damn it! It's about time. It's about time. It's about time. And uh, and Robert Newman's going to be showing up bald, you know, from his. Well, you know, he's doing. That's uh, right. He's, he's doing, doing Annie. He's doing Annie. Yeah. So he shaved all his head off. Wow. His hair off, rather. Oh, yeah. wow. So, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it's been nearly a year since Guiding Light stopped rap, stopped shooting. Yeah. Um, how has this year been for you? Well, I think for me it's been um, uh, when you go through something like this, you you get off your little back end and you go after something that you've always wanted to do. And for me, it's always been to write and produce my own show. And so that's that's kind of what I'm focused on doing right now. And you know. I, somebody asked me this question about, you know, do you miss every, I, I, I miss everybody terribly, but it's sort of like when I saw Guiding Light on 60 Minutes about a week ago, and I was watching, I'm thinking, oh man, I really miss everybody, but it's look, it's like looking at an old photo album, and you reminisce, and then you put that photo album, you put it in the shelf, and then you move on, and, and I think for me, that's kind of where I'm at. I want to move on, but at the same time, this weekend is going to be so great, because this is when you see all your buddies yeah. and you hook up and and then you see all these great fans that have you know supported us for for me 25 years yeah so it is interesting how such a sad event has led to so many new beginnings for you and for so much of the cast for so many people of the cast um, what can we look forward to or what's going on with Steamboat at this point when we did our interview a few months ago it was still a little right we were looking well, at ways well, to fund it well, we uh, we got nominated for best branded show uh, by uh, Napti. Okay. So we went out to Los Angeles, um, and although we didn't win, uh, we we're still top three in the country, which is pretty cool. Awesome. And so we're changing our focus to branded entertainment. Okay. And right now we've got some really um, important meetings with some big brands that are coming up, and I can't reveal exactly what my new strategy is, but. I'm pretty confident that within, say, two or three months, we're going to have Steamboat somewhere. That's inspiring and very good news for yep. me and for the fans of Steamboat and of Guiding Light. All right, Michael, I think they're, they're clamoring for you in there, oh. but I'm so happy to see you again. Okay. Again, we so look forward to seeing your work on Steamboat, your Thank comedy you. act. You're just, you're so awesome. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Okay.